welcome back to saturday night sit down where we talk about love marriage money and everything in between i'm your host tammy pinock on today's episode i want to talk on a topic it's a very funny topic but it's not funny it's very important i want to talk on a topic snoring broke my marriage yes snoring broke my marriage now i just want to dive in quickly you know i don't want to waste your time just dive in right in because i tend to realize that my videos are always too long so without wasting your time guys let's dive right in now uh i was talking to a, a lady we're just talking you know generally you know women talk just generally and uh she said uh uh that a marriage was uh like the marriage ended up basically because her husband was snoring and I'm like, what? <laughs> your marriage broke up because your husband was snoring? How is that even possible? But she said, yeah, that uh, snoring was the main thing that led to, you know, the breakup of the marriage. That because of the snoring and then other things started happening. And then. So I was very curious and I said, and I asked her, tell me what happened. I'm, I'm curious. And she said, you know, the husband snores heavily. That it snores like a horse. <laughs> a horse. I mean, is it a horse or a pig? <laughs> it says the husband snores like a pig. You know, very loud. Like. <laughs> oh, God. No, it's not funny. It's not funny, guys. Well, let me be myself. Well, it's, she said the husband snores like a pig that uh at first it was uh you know it was all right and then uh, after a while you know after some years into the marriage that it was so bad that uh, it was preventing her from sleeping that she can't sleep and so she told the guy that uh he should move into the spare room because she's not sleeping so because of that you know it brought they started arguing well night time she will <laughs> She would help the guy in the, in the night. You know, she'll kick the guy in the night when he's sleeping. And when he wakes up, like, what is it? Why? She says, uh, you're snoring too much. I can't sleep. And because of that, you know, they were having issues. And she told him to move into the spare room because she can't take it anymore. So the guy moved into the spare room. And with time, their relationship started, you know, uh, they started growing apart. And she said from there, apparently the guy, you know, started, you know, chatting with uh, other ladies because he was in his own in his own room doing his own thing. She was in her own room doing her own thing. Once in a while, if they want to, you know, do their own business, he will come into her room and do what he needs to do and go back to his own room. And she said they just grew apart from, you know, from that from there on. And uh, the guy started saying. Uh, someone else and before that she said she even she herself she said she started feeling you know resentment towards her husband you know when whilst they were still sleeping together in the same bed with all the snoring and that started feeling resentment towards the husband so even she doesn't even want him to touch her and all of that and when the guy eventually moved into the other room he started chatting with this lady and before you know it one thing led, led to the other he started dating this lady and eventually the marriage was just, you know, that's it. And yes, apparently so. Uh, eventually, that was what led to the breakup of their marriage. And <sighs> I laughed. I shouldn't have. God knows I shouldn't have. But I laughed. And there is a reason why I laughed. And you might ask me why. Thought like how can a woman be so stupid and now she's regretting it because she said the man was a, the nicest man that she has ever met now she's saying that now she, you know the marriage is broke it's moved on 
she can't she's met few other men they just come and uh, <laughs> they just dive right through and dive out you know what i mean guys <laughs> so you know the ones that will come will just come some will just take her money some will just and they are out so now she's regretting that she, uh, she allowed her marriage to break and uh i just felt she's very, she's a stupid woman and uh, like i said i laughed i laughed because everybody snores okay let me not say everybody most people snore i don't know about you i snore <laughs> oh god i snore and funny enough i never used to snore you know i never used to snore until I came to this country and started walking like a man. Yeah. In Nigeria, I was all right, you know, nice. And, you know, uh, you know, my mom gives me money. She provides all my needs. All I just need to do is just look beautiful. Do my hair, paint my nails, wear nice clothes, and just look beautiful. But when I came to this country and reality knocked on my door, I started walking day and night. And then I was always tired. And I found out that I started snoring. So... Most people snore. Anyway, okay, let's leave me for now first. Let's talk about uh, things that can make, like, causes of snoring. And uh, we'll try and find out some solution. Because this is what I said to the woman. I said, you're very stupid. You're a foolish woman for you to just, because your husband snores, you capitalize on the problem instead of you looking for a solution. And this is the truth, guys. So for every problem, there is always a solution. If it's a problem, there is a solution. So we should stop capitalizing on the problems in our marriages and start looking at the solution or start finding possible solutions to our problems. Because there's no perfect man and there's no perfect woman. Everybody has their flaws. And when you stood on the altar or you stood in the in the in the registry, you know, making your vows, you did promise that man that it was for better for worst. You promised that woman that it was for better for worst. So just snoring, and you think that's too much for you to, to compromise or handle, that you have to now humiliate the man and make him feel like uh it's an alien. When men are snoring and women are snoring, people are snoring. Men snore, women snore. Everybody snores. Everybody snores. Everybody snores. Almost everybody. Let me stop. Let me keep stop saying everybody. Almost everybody snores. You know. So for you to, after making vows to say, for better for worse, in sickness in health till death do us part. And then because your husband is snoring now, you're, 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 you're hating your husband. You don't want to sleep next to him because he snores. So when you lying on the day that you, that you, you exchange those vows, so we should stop focusing on the problems in our marriages. You know, some people, some women, they complain over little things in their marriages. Oh, my husband doesn't help me around the house, but he does everything else. Oh, my husband doesn't do this, but he does everything else. So why can't you compromise? Some will say, my wife doesn't do this, but she does that. She does everything else. Why can't you compromise? You said for better, for worse. I know there are some instances whereby, maybe because of violence in the home, you know, the, there has to be a separation and the woman has to move on. Yes, that's understandable. But when you talk about little things, oh, my husband doesn't help me around the house. My my wife doesn't do this. My little, little things. Come on. Find a solution. Stop focusing on the problems. Anyway, let's move on for that so that I don't get this video too long. Snoring is very common and it's not usually caused by anything serious. It is very common. And it's not usually caused by anything serious. Now, uh, causes of snoring. Snoring is caused by things such as your tongue, your throat, your mouth, or your airway in your nose vibrating whilst you breathe. And it happens because, you know, this part, maybe like your tongue, your throat, your airway, you know, this part of your body relaxes and they narrow when you sleep 
so some people because when they sleep their tongue relaxes backwards and that cause uh, you know a partial obstruction of the flow you know of their airway so it causes them to snore and you might likely snore if you are overweight so most people that are overweight tend to snore and smokers as well if you're a heavy smoker yeah most smokers tend to snore and people that drink too much alcohol people that drink too much alcohol you know like our men even our women in africa they drink so much they drink alcohol like horse like animals and you will see them you see a man his body is not you know the body is not it's not fat but the belly <laughs> the belly is like a drum the, their belly is even bigger than, than than seven months old pregnant woman because of too much drinking they drink like 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 a fish is it a fish now or a horse i don't know what to say they drink so much so you know it makes them snore a man with a with, with a with a belly like a pregnant woman of course he will snore or women as well you see most nigerian girls or african girls they, they drink some drink alcohol more than men and their bellies everywhere you see uh, fats from the side the belly is like everywhere so these are things that will make you snore or people that sleep on their back you know the tend to snore so because when you sleep on your back you know your your tongue will relax and fall backwards and that causes an obstruction to your airway and that will that tend to make uh people snore now there are things that you can try to help you that might help you you know stop snoring or use it for you you know things that can help you stop snoring now one of the things that can help you stop snoring is for you to try to lose weight if you are overweight that will help uh, reduce your snoring and also your as uh, you know as a husband or a wife if your partner is snoring and it's disturbing you you can try and use earplugs you know those little uh foamy kind of thing that you you put in your ears so try to use earplug that will that will help you you know uh, reduce the sound coming from your partner snoring and also there are some you know special pillows that you can use you know, like if you lie on your side, you, you tend to stop snoring. So there are special pillows that you can buy that will support you just to lie on your side. I know some people, they lie on their side because they know they snore. And so they lie on their side. But in the course of the night, they tend to roll and then they start snoring. So you can get those special pillows that will support you to lie on your side through the night. And that would help you also, you know, to stop snoring or reduce your snoring now if you have tried all of the above you know you've you've tried to lose weight uh you've stopped drinking you've stopped smoking and uh, and so when you stop drinking and stop smoking it's good for your health anyway so you've stopped your you, you you've stopped smoke smoking you've stopped drinking you've tried to lose weight you're doing exercises and uh you're trying you you're using those special pillows and none of those is working then that means it is time for you to see your gp which is a general practitioner back home in africa your doctor so when you try all of those uh and it's not working and uh the snoring is still seriously affecting your partner because when it gets to that stage that it's seriously affecting your partner that your partner as well is not sleeping then it becomes a problem it becomes a problem uh like the lady said you know when you look at it from another angle you don't it, she didn't handle it properly or the way she should but it becomes a problem when your snoring keeps your partner up at night so when it's affecting your partner seriously and you've tried every other thing and it's not working and also when you feel sleepy during the day or when you like you're always tired during the day so you sleep all night uh but during the day you're still always tired you find yourself that you're always tired you still want to sleep you know all through the day it is time to see your doctor and also when you when you're, when you're sleeping at night if your partner sometimes feel that you are gasping for breath or you're making you know shocking noises then it is time to see your doctor because 
you might be suffering from what is called sleep apnea. You might be suffering from what is called sleep apnea. And this is why I was like, the lady just capitalized on the problem. She didn't uh, look for solution. Because some people that snores, it's not just snoring. It's a medical condition. So sleep apnea is a medical condition. And if it goes untreated, it can lead to serious health issues. So uh, basically, sleep apnea is, you know, obstruction of your airway. It causes, you know, partial uh, obstruction of your airway whilst you sleep. It's led to, you know, serious health complications for some people. So sleep apnea is a medical condition that needs to be treated. So when you've tried all the other things, like I said, you've tried uh, losing weight, you've tried uh, sleeping on your side, you know, you've stopped smoking, you've stopped drinking and uh, still no no changes, then it's time to see your doctor. And for those of you that maybe you're not, you're not a smoker, you're not a drinker, you're not overweight and you're still snoring heavily, then it is time to see your doctor. You might just be suffering from sleep apnea. And sleep apnea, like I said, is a medical condition that uh, is an obstruction or partial obstruction of your airway so sometimes in the night whilst that person is sleeping the person actually stop breathing for some seconds like literally they stop breathing so it's as if they die for some seconds whilst they're sleeping and like i said if it's not treated it can lead to health complications uh for that individuals so if you're still snoring after you've tried all those things that i've said please see your doctor and uh, when you see your doctor they they, they 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 will they will conduct some tests uh they do what they call you have to go for a sleep clinic you go in there for the, they, they do some tests on you and then if they find out that you're suffering from sleep apnea which is a medical condition uh there is what they call a cpap that the doctor will give to you a CPAP is a machine. Uh, I don't know if I have the picture. If I, if I can find the picture, I will upload it and add it to this clip so you can see what the machine looks like. So they will give you a, a, a CPAP machine. CPAP machine is just something that you, you put water. It's got a container that you fill with water in the night. And then you put the, there's one that you just put into your nostrils. And there's another one depending on if you're breathing with your nose at night or you breathe with your mouth. So for people that breathe with their mouth whilst they sleep, they give you the one that covers the entire, your entire face. The, the CPAP machine, when you sleep at night, it, it pushes air. That's the word. It pushes air through your airway and helps you to breathe better. And then when you put when you when you wear that in the night, snoring stops completely. It stops completely. And for those of you that you know, if you're somebody that breathes with your nose whilst you sleep, they give you the one that goes straight into your nostrils, and uh, that helps you to stop snoring. So you can still sleep with your man. You can sleep sleep with your woman in the bed. You can still hug. You can still do all the things that you used to do. You know, there is always a solution to every problem. So, well, that's just uh, one of my educational videos. I just want to talk about uh, snoring and how you can stop snoring or reduce snoring or go to your GP. You might be suffering from sleep apnea and there's a solution to that that will help you stop snoring. So, that's it for me, guys. Today... Thank you so much for taking your time to join me and uh, if you're new to my channel you are very very welcome please consider subscribing so that you'll be the first to get a notification whenever i upload a new video and also please just give me a thumbs up by hitting the like button when you do that it just helps me to promote my channel well till next week saturday i remain your host chami pinak bye for now bye Take a, 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 take a,